rush potential works well with their lineup. Double bloodlusted heroes, and also they can just go around and get that rush really easily because of the TA. So chaos. Oh, it's gonna be the Weaver. It's gonna be the Weaver. Yeah, for they carry faded. Weaver in for. Oof. Matu, he's won a fair few games in his time on the, the old lone druid. Mm -hmm. See if this is going to be the magic that they need to, to carry them through this game for chaos. As well. Nice block Locked there by Milan. By the Fisher. He has still got a refraction to rely on. And we'll pop it as the fish comes he's, up. He's, he's getting ready to he's pop the fairy fire. He's just dead. He is dead. That's Matu. beautiful there by Milan. Yeah, that's, that's, your, that's your first blood. Matu getting that. It was, even a, it was an orb of venom there. The right side of it from his perspective, the wrong side of it from Chaos is it'll be fine for now. There's going to be more attention thrown towards mid, and here's that level dive. Five. Yeah, he's loaned for the dive here. Misery's here too. The so root comes out. There's going to be a TP in from Tims. Tims keep Armel safe. Tims, he's going to focus towards Matu. Armel trying to run his way away from the bear. There's another Fisher out. Armel's falling low. They'll get the kill. They're able to get one. They can maybe try for Tims too. He's blocked up still by the remainder of that Fisher. He's still pretty tanky. But Chaos, three heroes chasing down the Ogre. Milan doing his best, best to body block him off. And Another root comes in. Chaos. They'll get both kills in the middle. Bounty runes coming up now too, so the supports are probably going to reset and go look for those. But yeah, well worth it. Nice rotations coming in from the two of them to put that pressure on as the bear exactly as he hits five. So yeah, the TP switching can make things difficult. Stop Cuckoo. This will be the next target as they come in forward. Three heroes. Got Milan here too. Should have a good shot of this with a fish up being lined up onto the two of them. Cuckoo will fall. ENC again. Yeah, also losing kills to these rotations from Milan and his shaker mid lane. The roots out, but AU is here this time to help him out. So Matu won't be able to dive any further. Armel safe. Chaos though, putting the pressure on the lanes here at this start. Immediately too, they TP back toward top with the bat rider that TNC has that they want to be playing around. Oop. Milan walks up to the high ground there. He has got Matsu coming to help him. Yep. So. Three. TNC unable to chase the Fisher from Milan. Sets up onto AU, gets the Baron on First top of him, but between the two of them, Chaos, they'll get the kill. Another one for Matsu now on a killing spree on his mid lone Druid. All right. Getting a lot of kills and action going the way of this, this Matsu and his bear. Able to get that catch up, of course, as he's TA. Yeah, and he top. The jungle, but top. Do they have enough this time? They, they do. Once again, chaos. Misery and Milan getting the work done. And people said duo roaming. I mean, it's absolutely working. And they could even look to bring Kezu into some of these aggressive plays now, too. He's level six, about to be level seven. And that's he's a pretty damn good hero versus Armel, versus that TA. He could look to set up for some dives in mid. Milan, this time will be the one to go down. Yeah, they'll put an end to his roaming. Yeah. Emphasizing super heavily now on the rotations. If you see the wards right now placed by TNC, they bring all three cars. All three cars actually showing in the mid lane here to beat on and secure this tower. Look at it. Yep. TNC looking like they're they're looking to just play more of like an efficient farm game rather than set up and look to actually defend those towers. Misery has the track online. Watch this. Hits. Yeah, with the help of faded should be should be a pretty solid kill, and it is. There's the first track kill of the game. This is where you'll certainly start to see that gold league grow if Chaos can keep these sort of kills up. Yep. It's only 40 bonus, but it is DNC. It's like, who's going to really show up to do that? He's not like a leader. There's no Grim Stroke. There's nothing like that. He just defend the towers very well. Okay. So they're going to look to fight instead. He is. The tower has fallen. He's got the last, so there'll be a TP coming in from Gabby. Gets the stun off, but already the Shikuchi's out. The still dies here to the cleave. Matsu goes for the TP out. He's not going to make it. Stun from Tims. Holds him back. Okay, and Gabby shows up, and now maybe he just switches back to the Echo Saber because of that. Yep, but he already had the uh, Oblivion stuff actually bought. He's already got the Echo Saber now finished. Kezu, very confident as he walks forward because he has a plate mail as well as the veil. Gabby. So the bear. He's going to start to poke at the bear. Running around the shrine, will be feared back. He's rooted, he's stunned Gabby. up. Gabby's falling low, the chain control. stuns there. Milan's got the control, gets the jump for the BKB though. The shrine, he's ready to turn. They turn towards the egg, the egg's out, they'll kill it. Gabby does fall, it's a one for one. Now Chaos make the run for Armel. Armel, he's been tracked. Matthew's on top of him, Lasso on the side, controlling Faded, but Faded can turn, look towards Cuckoo. Milan, he's back in, he's on top of Armel. Armel's rooted, surrounded, he'll fall too. Chaos get the two of them, and they're not done yet. They're, they're diving past the tier two tower. They're on top of Tim's with the track. They won't go to the tier three, but they'll certainly be happy with that outcome. Sure, 
The Phoenix dies, the egg's taken out, but they lose both Gabby and Armel. Another tier two just picked up the blink dagger. Okay, they've got a way to actually start the fight this time around. Chaos. Are they going to be prepared for this? There's the jump. They're going to start looking what's fading. Gabby moves in with a BKB. Yeah. A great positioning for Kezi though. He's on the high ground. The egg. Is it going to be successful? Cuckoo's up. They can they kill it in time? They can't. The egg's out. It's a pop. Matches onto Tim's. The Hannah God heal comes through. They'll lose Tim's. Chaos themselves also feeling like they did lose Faded. They've got two kills in return, Chaos. There'll be a buyback from Tim's. Cuckoo's dead for 40. Armel tries for the bear, but Matu Ooh. brings him back just in time to keep the bear alive. That was some. That Beautiful positioning there by Kezu. Straight up to the cliff, and it, it was... TNC, but TNC, they do have a BKB now on Armel. He's going to feel a lot safer to commit forward. No God Strength for 30. Cuckoo's spawning out the situation. Gabby's going to jump in. He's going to pop the BKB. So is Armel, but the fish is going to block them off away from Matu. They can't reach Matu. Milan providing the wall of safety, stopping TNC from getting the kill that they tried to commit for with those BKBs. Well, they won't get it. Beautiful by Milan. That was literally the most perfect fissure I've seen in quite a long time. And mid lane. out perfectly as Tim's. The track's out, the chase is on, Tim's is dead. Chaos forcing TNC back away from the pit despite TNC being the ones that are trying to interrupt this Roshan attempt. And that had been a Tim's buyback. They have a Batrider Lasso, they also have God Strength now, but the BKBs are down. And the Supernova's available again for Kezu. Can they go for a snatch here? Cuckoo. Cuckoo. Definitely gonna want to try. He's ironed up the Sunray being used to try and stop it. Cuckoo's gonna jump in, but the fear's there in time. It will send him back to just the egg as well, just in case there was further the jump in. Won't be the, won't be the case, but it does the job. This is a big timing here for Kezu. They've, they've not only just gotten the edges for themselves, but they're denied denying it away from a TA. We talk about that all the time, how important it is. Yeah, they're starting to be in some problems. Phoenix, Ke Kezu, healing up the bear. Chaos all grouped up. They're looking to pressure here in this mid lane. There's still a God Strength available. They have the BKB available for Gabby now too, as well as Armel. They're still positioned aggressively here. TNC, they're looking to fight though. They've got the flakes. Oh, God Strength's in. They're going to jump with the lasso. Gabby, he's focusing now. Matumba, they have the stun control. The summary is healing up a little bit. Matu will finally die. TNC get the kill. Chasing out the Phoenix as well as the Earthshaker. He has his BKB. Misery does show there as he goes for the poke. Gabby, run him down, stuns out. Misery's gonna pay the price for showing his face. Double kill for Gabby. And straight to Bounty Rune says the nighttime hits. Both teams will run to those as it looks like Chaos will be able to claim the three off of that at least after they lose their lone druid. So quick up. Chaos, jump four from Milan. Bear. The Fisher. It's getting slowed, the traps for the Sunray. Yeah, it's burning him. Getting shredded by the damage output from this Phoenix. Oh no, and Tim's 42 seconds dead. 42 seconds with the Midas. Oh. Well, he's gonna have to get that multi multi cast to make up for that when he spawns. Gabby. Okay, Misery walks into his descent. Walks into some vision here. Ah, but the, they, they, they've got the Fisher to back him up. Milan's gonna oh. keep him safe. Oh. He's stuck. He's stuck because of this Fisher. They actually have to cut the tree and with the, the Firefly. Gabby has to BKB and run away. They actually have to pop the hand of God. Kezu moves forward. Faded. 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 Just going in. They're going to get Cuckoo. They're just diving into the base. Oh my God. Forcing TNC back in chaos. They've got the space to put the pressure onto the tier 3 tower. And it's DD. He's just chipping down the tower. They're going to probably... Back, back to this one. Actually, they've got to look for the racks. Cuckoo is up, but they know. BKB still down for Gabby. It's very hard for him to fight. The threat of the Phoenix Soul is there. They do get the grab onto the Weaver. They drag him back underneath the tier 4. The stuns are out. They'll take him down once. He's got the Aegis and he also had the time. That's the melee racks will be taken faded. Shakooting away. He's going to be able to get out of there underneath the safety of the sun. Great defensive egg there by Kezu as they protect themselves for their retreat. Gabby, he looks like he wants to commit forward. It's got to be Misery. The BKB's still on cooldown, 12 seconds for him. Tim's can't quite find the stun onto faded. They do find the stun onto the bear. And will be 300 gold they clean up. Armel having to put the BKBs. He looks towards Faded. There'll be a buyback from Misery. So he wants to come and help the team back out. Armel goes for the BKB TP to get out of there. Back to safety. Milan jumps in. But oh, the angle. Gabby. Gabby. Oh, it's a beautiful stun. Oh, it's a triple Chris. kill. Gabby, he's not done yet. He's running towards Kezu. He's chasing him down with the wall grind. Kezu's dead too. Oh my god. Now Faded. He's getting stunned up. The multicast. As TNC oh out god. of nowhere just pop off and shut Chaos down. Oh my. Was that. It was a crit into a regular hit into another crit coming out from Gabby. He got two 1k crit. Uh. Gabby is very terrifying right now. Bloodlusted Sven with this Daedalus. Bugs are out. 
bait it. Poking forward. Yeah, he's going to pay for that. The lasso's there, yours. Gabby. He's waiting for the angle. He's going to jump in. He's looking for the backlights. Making sure Milan can't get into the fight. Commits. Now he turns towards the egg. Tim's coming across as well. Armel. He's offering the hits on the egg. Can they take it off the time? They can't. Gabby gets the double kill. Turns over towards Misery. Now looks back towards Faded. Faded going in on Stiz with the Shikuchi. They'll lose the ogre. Oh. But Gabby, he kills off a third. He's able to find Misery. Get the triple kill into the trees. Out he goes. Gabby escapes. As Gabby continues to carry TNC back towards the lead of this game. As they'll lose Cuckoo. But the power of this Sven is just continuing to grow. He keeps finding the perfect target. He jumps out to Milan. Kezu actually gets the clutch play there with the Agnims that he just picked up. Picks him up into this into that egg. Backlines. Go here, Gabby. He's hit. It's a two-man stun straight away. Looking for the opening for the ghost step. He keeps Maddie safe. The lasso onto Faded with the BKB. Time lapse keeps Faded back up to full. They'll now turn towards Gabby, focusing the Sven. Kezu's in with the ult. They've just got to get out of it. TNC Armel won't be able to escape. Tim's as well. It's been isolated from the rest of the team as chaos. And back to taking the fights in their favor. They get both the two Milan. of them. Jump forward from Milan. He's trying for more. Gabby's able to turn though and kill Milan off. VT faded and Kezu unable to get on top of them in time. They'll dive forward. Gabby's teeping back to base. Stuns out. On to faded underneath the tower. We'll back away. Milan did try and see if he could fish for more kills for the team, but ends up giving away his life. Yeah. Matu able to disengage pretty nicely that Ghost Scepter and the BKBs, like we mentioned, they're low. Gabby, he's used it every single time, so that five second deep BKB will jump forward and the Sunray heals everybody up again. Yeah, they do want to stick around Chaos to try and force that melee Rax. They're going to go up again. Armel's on the front, starts to hit into Faded. Faded pops the time lapse, fishes out. Onto Armel, no further commitment as of yet from Chaos. They'll start to move in with the bear. The bear actually bringing Armel down very low. He has to put the BKB started jump for Gabby. Top, Gabby's in on the back lines. Ghost Scepter keeps Matu safe. We'll turn for VT Faded. Faded still. Keeping that Aegis safe for now. They'll have the lasso onto Misery instead, as Misery will be the one to fall. Everyone else from Chaos gets out, and the Aegis is still protected. They can still go for another push for it. But we did. We'll see if they want to wait until Misery's back in, as they do still have a. I think the last off straight away, they try and focus down onto the Weaver. Weaver will fall once. That's the Aegis gone. Gabby keeps itself to the edge, and they'll get themselves away from the sun. The supernova. Won't do anything apart from push TNC away. They didn't have to, co they what, committed the BKB from the TA, but not the BKB from the Sven. So Gabby. Gabby still has his both available, BKB as well as God Strength. Back themselves up onto that high ground. And they're able to at least clear the Aegis, which was getting reclaimed in about 30 more seconds or so, but they make an aggressive play forward and try to catch Chaos off guard. DD rune up top, we'll see if TNC we able to scout that one out. Time's no, no, up, no, 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 no. He, no, he even yeah. refreshed, he refreshed for sure. He's good up again now, Fady Fady, he gets grabbed up. Yep, they're gonna grab him. There's gonna be the egg straight out there. She's gonna look to turn towards the egg with the BKBs. They're gonna do a good job of taking it's it out. Oh, they got it, they get the egg. It's a double kill for AU out of all the people on the team. The Chad coming in big, taking the last hits on both of those. Milan, he actually gets the blink off. Is he gonna do it? Oh, no, he's not. Cuckoo. Finds him. He's hot on the chase of misery. Will be saved by the bear fear bat. Okay, they did okay. not expect that. That's yes. that was the refresher play right there coming into play from Gabby. They didn't. The, 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 the 700 IQ play. It really is. Gabby, he's trying for more. Okay. And yeah. Hey, you. Like you said, him getting the last hit on that, that egg there. That did it. Looks kind of funny as he gets the double kill, but. It happened to Namatumba. He's getting chased out by the rest of them. He is not going to be able to escape from here. He does not have a TP either. Gabby, he's got the start. Him. They, they've got him. They've got him as well. Yep, and that's a Look gem. Look at that. Hitting the deck. So they're able to pick that gem up as well for themselves. Yeah. I mean, I, thinking about I think why Gabby bought the refresh and then sold it was because he wanted to make sure he had buyback as well. Yeah, that makes sense. Because he had 5,000, about 5,700 gold. And then that put him at like 2,800. He used it for okay. that play. That makes sense. Or for the preparation of that play. And could have jumped straight away in the fall with the BKB in the last two. He's got the grab. Armel's in with the damage to Misery. fall. Misery's dead. They'll look towards Faded. Faded gets the time lapse out. He's back up the fall. The supernova being used, but TNC, they're able to easily walk away from it. It's not in a good spot this time around. They kite it out. And the only thing to result from that fight is a dead Misery. Chaos now down a member around this Roshan time. They have their God Strength, it was used, and the BKB as well, but you see Gabby does have that Refresher. Where do you actually put it? Okay, he gave the Refresher. That one's Kezu, Kezu, he's dead, no buyback. Oh my, that's like the-, the Kuku. That was the best target he could buy. Kezu committed his gold. He bought the Refresher. Hey, no, he didn't. Yes, he did. Yes, he did. He has no buyback. He's not got the buyback. 
He is the most important hero on the team on the side of yep. Chaos. Yep. Oh no. Kill for Chaos. Tim's now the looks for Tim's. Jump in for Gabby. BKB's out in time to dodge the stun. Gabby's committing. They've got He's the kill. Dead. Faded is just straight up dead. As Gabby cuts him down, the egg hits nobody. The DD plus, I think a Melt Bash stopped yeah. him, right? The it Melt, the melt Bash got him, and it also got Misery. Oh my. Cuckoo's even fishing for more. As he jumps in, chases down Chaos, he's got his eyes on Milan, he sidesteps the Fisher, Lasso is out, Gabby's gonna get another one out of this as Chaos lose three. TNC are playing this, this half of the game to perfection as Chaos, they came relatively close to having what looked to be a win, but at this point, yeah, sort of mid portion of the game, Tims. Absolutely, Tims. Has the protection for himself. Go Scepter plus a Lotus. Yeah, they can't quite kill them off. Faded. Tries to commit the dude. Get the bash off for Gabby. The bear. We'll jump bear. in onto the bear with the Mel bash as well. The bear. It's getting beaten down. The bear is dead. dead. They've got a resummon. Tim's being focused now. VT faded. Popping the BKB to try and commit for this ogre kill. They'll get it. They will find VT faded. Armel going for the TP out. And he'll make it with that BKB. Nothing to cancel it in time. As they couldn't quite believe, but get Matu close enough to allow the bear to hit and try for a bash. Was disarmed, but they push DNC back. We'll get them away from their half of the map for now. So there's a gem though. They see him. They're gonna look to commit. Armel's in. Oh, the hex! The hex. Gets hex! Oh no! Is he gonna go down? He is! He is! He's dead! The hex blade catches him off the guard, off guard, and, and with the drag back of this lasso, they'll find Matu too. Oh my god. What was it? That's AU with the hex, right? And from AU. the high ground, with that 200 cast range yeah. talent on the Chen level 10, he gets that far hex. Kezu not expecting that one from the high ground there. Instantly grabbing him off guard. Oh my god. And now 75 seconds. Nope. The Aggie comes into play. Arm out. They are looking for arm out. Gabby. Gotta get caught by the stun, it's a long one too, because it is the buffed up edge. Do they have the damage to kill him? He's gonna be forced to Another safety, one. there's gonna be an override, but Armas just on top of it with the BKB. Kezu's egg is dying, Kezu's dead! The egg's taken out! The, the egg oh, It's a big one! It's a big one! It's a big one! Is it enough though? It's not. It's and not enough. It it's not enough. It's not enough. It gets Armel, but Armel buys back. As there's three dead on Chaos. A big echo, but an echo a little too late from Atlanta's. Oh. This game is over. GG is called, and TNC take game one oh, it was against a, Chaos. It was a beautiful echo, but yeah. It did him. It, Ten, it was far too 600 late. 600 hand It was far too yeah. late. Yeah, it really it was, was. I mean, it was the only There wasn't any follow-up. It still was yeah. exciting, but there was no yeah, follow-up there yeah. at the end.